guys, literally having to freaking go into security is the hardest thing of my life, especially when I try to fit in like every single thing that could probably fit into my backpack and then I have to take my laptop out and then I have to take my watch off and that's just super, um, what do you call it? Yeah, super uncool. And it's like freaking 5.30 in the morning. Do you think I'm in the mood for this? No. I'm super sleepy and super tired. I don't even know where I'm going to be honest. <laughs> So obviously, since I was so distracted talking to my phone, um, I went the wrong way. It's fine though. I'm literally here like seven hours early. Super, but some would say, late. Never in my life have I been to like a Pete's Coffee. Don't know if I've heard of this in my entire whole life. Um, I ordered a like, cold brew oat latte, but they don't have oat milk. So I guess it's a cold brew coconut latte because I got coconut milk instead which my dad says coconut milk tastes nasty and maybe on its own it does but like I like it in my coffee so it should be fine it was a reckon seven bucks though a little out of my price range you guys but it's fine because I literally feel like I'm about to pass out you guys this is literally what I paid seven dollars for and I just freaking realized there's a Dunkin' Donuts here. I think it's me, time for me to really just call it a night and a day and go home. Anyway, everyone here is super quiet, so I don't know how good this vlog is gonna be. People are so late. I'm only gonna live off my coffee pretty much until like 1 p.m. later. I'm so tired. Um, but I'm really debating buying a snack or not. I don't know. Because if I buy a snack, then I'm gonna be thirsty, so I need to buy another drink. And I'm kind of too lazy to get up, if I'm being really honest. So I think I'll just starve and dehydrate. You guys are probably like, Andrea, you look stupid as heck right now. Yeah, I do. But I'm so bored. I get so bored on these things because I'm. I have no besties with me. You guys, let me tell you, half of the stuff I'm taking is little, literally Bucky's gear. Like, like Bucky should sponsor me because I literally am getting all my besties from North Carolina, like Bucky's gear. This man is singing, bro. I mean, whatever makes you happy. If you wanna sing, then sing. You guys, my boarding pass literally fell on the floor. And then this guy was like, excuse me? And then I was like, yeah. And then he was like, your boarding pass fell. And I was like, oh, I was like, oh my gosh, thank you. And then you know what else I said? I said, sorry. I'm so silly, you guys. Just kidding, I'm literally so embarrassing. I embarrass myself. I straight up can't believe there's legit a Dunkin' Donuts here and I didn't go to it. Instead, I went to a little Pete's Coffee. Freaking scammers. Hey you guys, so basically I look sweaty and disgusting. You guys will never know what happened to me. I ended up getting a middle seat. And you know what happens when you get middle seats? You're squished. Mm -hmm. And it was not fun. I did not enjoy it. Anyways, you guys, I'm not gonna be here for an hour. I am also now moving to the front because I didn't like the other seat too much. You guys, I am finally out. I mean, like, don't get me wrong, I'm really thankful my parents didn't put me in a bus that would last for like three, four days, you know? But like, wow, it does not mean this is the best form. I wish I could just teleport, you know? Would have been so much easier. Yo, you guys, I just got off and someone told me I've been gone for five years. Nah, I'm just kidding. I'm just waiting for my luggage now. You guys, I literally swear that same luggage has been going around the little convertible like five times. Anyway, it's like so hot, you guys. But it doesn't even matter because Corinne's not even here yet, so I'm not like in a rush or anything. I thought I was gonna be in a rush, but I'm not, which is fine. But I'm tired and I'm hungry. 
my biggest fear is actually that they're gonna end up losing my luggage. That's why I always have like really bad like anxiety whenever I'm waiting because I think they're gonna lose it and that'll probably be the end of the world for me because that's where all my things are and I'll probably cry a lot. Unless they find it, then I would stop crying. It's literally like my biggest fear with flying. Like if the plane crashes, whatever. But if my luggage gets lost, oh my gosh, is that mine? No, that's not mine. Guys, my luggage is actually taking a little bit of time and um, I'm kind of freaking out. But I have two, so it's like if they were to get lost, it's not like both could get lost, you know? You don't have to look like, right? I hope not. I'll cry. I'll cry and throw up. Okay, besties, I got my first luggage, which is the big one, which is the one that has the most things. And it was literally new, you guys. It's so pretty. And it was trash. But you know, that's what I get for being cheap and buying it for $50 instead of $1,000. If you know this is what it is, I got it at Ross, 50 bucks. Pretty good deal because I went to Macy's to look for some and they were literally like $1,000, which I was obviously not gonna pay. Guys, Corinne just picked me up and she told me I've been missing for five years. She literally told me that, you guys. She, had, she hasn't aged at all though, like not to me. <laughs> okay, you guys, I made it to school and literally I don't know what to do. I don't know where to go me and my luggages it looks like i'm stranded i thought like the people were supposed to be here at belk patio handing out keys maybe but they're not here and they said at two and it is 151 but it's only a 10 minute difference you know i don't know i don't know and it's really hot and i'm really freaking dehydrated i have no water i have i'm so hungry i literally haven't eaten since like the freaking coffee I had in the morning and like the pretzels I had. I'm starving, I'm thirsty, and I just want to get my key, pretty much. And I don't know where to do that. You guys, I literally wanna cry, I'm so tired. It's like, I don't know, it's like 1.58 and there's no one here in the Belk Dining Hall patio to check in. And I don't know if like maybe they team locations or something or like what's the vibe, what's the thing and um i'm hungry and i'm thirsty and i want to cry okay because i have to carry these two thingies that are like freaking 50 pounds each okay you guys i finally finally made it into my dorm it looks a little like how do you say this mm, vintage um really gives me like i'm really poor in new york vibes you know and i am a really poor person in general so maybe it's what i deserve who knows Anyway, let me give you a little tour because there's like nothing set up. First of all, this is our bathroom. It looks just kind of like I am El Chapo in jail. But you know, it'll have to do. It'll have to do. And I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that at this point because I already peed. And that's the first time I peed since like 6 a.m. this morning. And I didn't even drink water. I'm so dehydrated, you guys. It's fine. Anyway, this is the beginning. You know, you walk into the door. Like this is the door's like right behind me. You walk in. You see these desks. Um, this random space of nothing, nothing fits here, but they have this little tiny hole, which honestly is great for storage or for crying, to be honest. There's like these little shelves, which works kind of nice. There's one bed here where I put all my stuff. I don't know if that's going to be my bed yet or not. Um, they have these two closets. Pretty good. I, I buy with it. I, I'm okay with that. I have one of those at home if you haven't seen. There's another bed here, and there's another desk, and then this little like... Thank you. Um, and then there's like another space here. And there's no other little door here or anything, but like it's still nice, you know? Anyways, that's the tour. And you know, I'll give you guys a full dorm tour once me and Kendall have organized and made it look pretty and stuff. So, um, you know, that'll be that. But um, of course I go a side where there's no freaking sun. It's fine. Even though I'm a sun girl, it's fine. I'm fine. It is so fine, you guys. Can you tell I literally need some caffeine ASAP? I think I'm gonna make a grocery list and go like grocery shopping because I literally don't have any food or any resources or any material right now. But I have to get some paper signed. Oh, so much to do. I will um, TTYL, I guess. Um, I guess this is it for the vlog. That's my flight vlog. Um, besides that, um, TTYL.